guys welcome back to my channel so today i have this next character for my halloween series can you guess well you know i'm just not even gonna say that anymore but because you probably read the title of the video duh who doesn't but this is les cons from the Cirque du Soleil show la nuba which is in florida which is opening until uh december 31st this year and then after that it'll be gone so you guys i'm trying to go see it pray that i go because i need to see this show because they've been there for 20 years and those 20 years i've never been there i've never been like to disney <laughs> teardrop <laughs> but yes i did not shave my head um some of my followers wanted me to shave my head and i put a poll up and i was like you know maybe my followers got my back and don't want me to shave my head Nah, I got like 68% wanted me to shave my head and then 30% were like, no, don't do it. And I was like, well, I know who to trust and who not to trust. But, you know, I would shave my head off, but I have um, self-esteem problems. So I am wearing a bald cap from a Halloween store. And yeah, it's fun. So hopefully you guys like this. If you guys want to know how I created this look, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, follow me on social media, and give this video a thumbs up. And without further ado, if you guys want to know how I created this character, then just keep on watching. Alrighty guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry I've been MIA. So we're going to go ahead and put that ball cap on her head did that off camera apply latex underneath the ball cap so it can stick better and then go ahead and do a little layer of latex over to cover the seams of the latex just to blend it into your you know your head once you have the, that done I went ahead and did my eyebrows off camera so they can dry about the same time and then apply a little bit of translucent powder just to make it less sticky once I did that, I went ahead and took my Ben Nye White Foundation and applied that all over my head, as well as all over my face. You know, take your time on this, because we want to get a really the best possible coverage, amount of coverage we can get, until you look like a white marshmallow. Next, I went ahead and took my Cosmic Blue Cream Color from Ben Nye and using this Morphe Flat Brush, I went ahead and created a receding hairline. I almost followed the same as mine. Uh, you, If you're bald, it'd be better if you did that, you know, without the bald cap and all that extra, all those extra steps. And I tried blending it out, but little did I know that latex and uh the cream colors like don't mix and it like dries it out like really 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 fast i don't know why someone explained to me in the comments i am new at that i am learning and then i went ahead and took this detail brush and brushed on the purple on the nostrils of my nose and on the parentheses smile line that i have you can go ahead and draw another one just so that in like when you get to the powder state you have like you know an outline of where you're gonna go over with the powder using that same purple I applied it on the filter of my nose and with my finger I tapped it out to you know smoothly blend it out and then go ahead and draw your eyebrows I am using the wet and wild eye coal pencil in black I believe that's what it's called and once you have drawn your eyebrows, go ahead and set your face. Get rid of those crease lines underneath and on your eyelids. Of your eyes. Underneath the, your eyes. That, that's what I meant. And once you got all your face, leave it for a couple of minutes and then brush off the excess powder you have left on the face using Cosmic Blue or Electric Eel. It was one of those two eyeshadows 
from MAC Electric Eel, I applied it on the blue parts of my face. And using the Ben Nye Purple Eyeshadow, I applied that on everywhere else I applied purple on your face. And then parentheses, parentheses, parentheses in your chin. And I took a little bit of a brown uh, blush, I believe. I'll put it in the description box below because it's been a while and I forgot. And then I applied Dusty Rose on the apples of my cheeks. I took a little bit more of that purple eyeshadow and applied it on my where my jawline is supposed to go. <laughs> And then this is what I meant of uh, doing the parenthesis smile line before so that way you have an idea of where it's going to go. And then we just uh, went ahead and kind of reshaped our nostrils. And then off camera I did my waterline and my top liner and I'm going to up we do my eyelid <laughs> I think that's how you say it I need to look up my makeup terms because it's been a month and I just used black track to do all of this and once you feel satisfied with how both of the eyelids come out using a small smudge brush you go ahead and blend that outward and using a bigger brush I took a little bit of the black eyeshadow from Ben Nye and I kind of smoked it outward like so and then I applied a little bit of the purple uh, eyeshadow in the center towards the outer part of the eye like so and then took a little bit of that black eyeshadow and I went ahead and filled in my eyebrows. Applied a little bit of mascara to get rid of that white on my eyelashes. And then my lips. Went ahead and took the red cream color from Ben Nye and filled in my lips. Kind of over, over, overdrawn it. Overdrew it a little bit. Not a lot. Just a dab. And once you have that, go ahead and set it with a little bit of powder so it won't go anywhere. Apply a little bit of red blush or red eyeshadow, whatever you got left, uh, you know, whatever you have available. Next, I took my Ben Nye Luxe Powder in Ice and applied it all over the white parts of my face just to make myself look shiny and sparkly. Yes, please. And once you are glittering to the gods go ahead and take your Ben Nye Cloud White Magic Cake and your MAC Mixing Medium and apply it underneath your eyes and once you have that done go ahead and draw a teardrop on the right side of your face once you have that done I didn't do this you, sh you can do this but uh, fill in that drop with a little bit of eyelash glue and apply some uh, cyan glitter and then set your face and you're done 